como si fuera una bomba, algo así. Boom, like it was a bomb, is how Arturo Serrano described the blast that woke up his neighborhood and briefly knocked out power. Whatever went off inside this minivan just after midnight, police say it ripped off the roof, blew out the windows, and showered neighboring cars with debris. I honestly just thought it was a transformer because the power went out for a second. But it wasn't a transformer, and according to Montclair police, it wasn't a mechanical malfunction either. It was something in the passenger seat. Neighbors say they saw a cloud of dust or smoke, but the minivan was never on fire. That's why police called in the FBI to help figure out what was inside the van parked on the 4500 block of Kingsley. We do believe there was some form of a crime. I mean, clearly there was an explosion that caused significant damage. Uh, thankfully, nobody was injured and there was no other property damaged. Adding to the mystery, police say they've spoken to the van's owners and found nothing that would make them targets of an explosion or suspects in this case. At this point in time, uh, there's no indication that they would have any involvement in any type of activity that would have resulted in the device inside the vehicle that exploded. The van's owners tell police that they parked it there after work at about five yesterday and never went back. The police chief says part of the problem with explosions is that they tend to destroy evidence. And that's why they're having so much trouble determining what caused it. But the chief added he doesn't believe there's any danger to the public. Live in Montclair, I'm Christy Fajardo. Alex, back to you. So I, where does this investigation go next? Well, they say that they have the FBI looking into it. They're the experts in explosives, also uh, just relying on the feds to help them determine what caused the explosion, and from there, if they need to look for a suspect or a motive. All right, Christy Fajardo, thank you so much.